Hey everybody, welcome back to more Pokemon Crystal. In the last episode, we started off the game, and we got our starter, Dylan, the Toted Isle, and this time, we're just gonna go into this house and talk, I guess, to Mr. Pokemon, he, er, Mr. Pokemans, and he, apparently he's very interested in our, uh, or this egg thing. Right. It's an egg, man. Well, apparently eggs are a whole new discovery back in, uh, I, I think around 2000. I'm not really sure when this game came out. It's, it's been a while. I know it's been 10 years or so. And Professor Oaks just, just being, like, amazed at my Pokemons. And he, I guess he's gonna give us, uh, oh, I guess he's just gonna ramble on first. Alright, come on, Professor Oak. Yeah, I, I guess if, if at the cost of us going on an adventure with, and training Pokemon to do our bidding, I mean, I guess with, with the cost of that, we, we could do this, but I don't know how we're gonna pull it off, so. Uh, Alright, yeah, okay. Who would watch that show? Why would you want to listen to Professor Oak rambling on? Forever. I know I wouldn't, which is why I won't be. Oh look, Professor Elm's calling us. What? Oh my goodness. Well, I guess we got some uh, some action going on at the lab, so we might as well go back and deal with whatever's there. We can. Oh, okay. Guess we got some fighting to do first. Oh, hello, Pidgey. Well, eh, these Pidgeys are fairly low level. They can't really do much because they're pretty weak, so I guess we'll just scratch their face open and leave it off with that. Alright. Yeah, apparently Tackle didn't do very much at all, but that's okay. So, you know, I'm, I'm, I've been thinking a lot about my runs and stuff that I've been doing. Like, I had Spore going on, and then Kingdom Hearts, and I quit Spore. I, I deleted it completely. I don't think I'll be going back to it. I thought, I decided it was kind of boring, but we'll see about that. It's not like, it, not really many people watched it anyways, but that's probably how I'm going to do it. I'm probably just going to go back and, um, get rid of it. Like, I, I think I did that already. Yeah, I did that already. And... If I ever go back to it, it'll be when I get a little more viewers and subscribers and stuff. Just, it, it, it'll help. But I may not, because there's other games that you guys would probably like more, and I like more. And, ah, oh, crap, if I die, I'm screwed. And by that, I mean, if I, he's the only team member in my party, so... Oh, jeez. Alright, level 8. But yeah, I deleted it. I'm sorry. Um, I know one person asked um, a request about making one. I might be able to do that still, but I don't think I'm gonna put up the put up a uh, another walkthrough of it. I it's not a big deal anyway. Besides, start at the beginning. It's not like I got many people, but I do plan on getting a little bit of a um subscribers base I hope from Kingdom Hearts because it's a very popular game and a lot of people are looking for a good quality and that's walkthrough and that's what I try to produce I hope and that's what I'm doing and I'm just kind of messing around here buying a bunch of crap seeing what I can get for my money I guess I can I guess I'll just spend it all nah we'll save those all right. Well, I guess I guess there's not much else to do, so I can really go that to the right and wait. Wait a second. Oh my God, it's a ginger. Suspicion. What a waste to wimp like you. Okay, this guy's abusing dots. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. And the ginger is gonna battle us. All right, so. 
Question mark, question mark, question mark, wants to battle. Alright, and he sends out a Chikorita. The reason I thought, um, before, that I'd have to train a lot, I actually don't, no, I mentioned that in my first recording, but I thought I'd have to train a lot. I got confused with the Shiny Gold X for some weird reason. Don't know why, but this is definitely not that, and thank you for the critical hit, Dylan, that was very helpful. Luckily enough, Chikorita is very weak, and its attack power is not that strong, so... I can deal with it very well, and I've been saying very way too much. But oh well, one more scratch and we can, uh, just finish that off, and there we go. Good job, Dylan. 67 experience. Too bad it's not 69. That would have been so much better. Unlike the old games. I, I don't know what N Nintendo was thinking, but I'm very sure. Man, why not? Again, with the very stuff. It's like, it's like my next I don't know. The point is... I'm pretty sure they were they weren't just thinking uh nothing when they decided to make it 69 experience. I'm positive. I know what you're doing out there, Nintendo. I'm I'm watching you. You you just better look. Just look out. And you better hide your kids and hide your wife. Hide your husband. Right and everybody. All right, and go to Professor Elm's lab. And oh my God, hello, cop. Where are you now? Alright then, well... Yes, I did. Alright, well, let's see. Rival names. Hmm. I don't know, to be honest. I'll be right back and figure that out. Alright, well, I've thought of a name. I know exactly what to name him. You are going to be Draken. Or Draken Geist. Or Geist. Five, six, five, six. Oh, God. He even pronounced his own name. Yeah, but he's a cool person, and he's my rival. So, yeah, I'm gonna kick your ass, Drac, just so you know. And I totally forgot to talk to Professor Elm. Great. None of you gonna be able to start. Dust, this is terrible. Oh, yes. What was Mr. Po well, you sure got over that quick. <sighs> Jeez. Oh, my God. He's I know it's an egg, right? No one's ever seen eggs before. Yeah, okay. Very cool. Yeah, so I remember from, like, the anime or something. Apparently this guy was, uh... I, I guess he was, like... He helped, uh... I don't know, he was an assistant. Yeah, I think he was an assistant to Professor Oak or something. Or Professor Rowan. One of the two, I don't know. I don't know the whole story or backstory to the... To Pokemon, really. But all I know is that his aid is gonna give us... His aides are giving us balls, and now that his aides gave us some balls, we are ready to go on an adventure. But wait a second, we have to talk to our mom first. I mean, you don't have to, but I recommend doing it anyways. Wow, that's a cute Pokemon. Ah, oh, thank you. Just give me... Just, just shut up. Just, just, yes. No, you won't help. Alright, she's gonna want us to save her money, and you know, you could do it. I don't want to. I'd like to have all my money with me. I find saving it to be stupid because you'll just spend your money on everything that's unimportant. The only way you want to do it is if you're want looking for a moonstone. And I guess for the team I'm looking for, you don't really need one. And there's this guy who's just standing us, uh, standing in the same spot and watching us for some odd reason. Oh crap! I hit yes. Well. Okay, well, I just cut that out, because I can show you how to do that myself. All he did was teach you how to catch a Pokemon, and that was very stupid. And completely pointless, because all you do is use Tackle and throw a Pokeball. Alright then, well, I handled that. In here, actually, there's some good Pokemon you get in there. I believe you can get a Spearow, Geodude, and a... Fanpy. Fanpies are only in the morning though, and they're very rare, and they and they tend to flee a lot. So I'd be very careful about that. Alright, Dylan Alright, Dylan got to level nine there. And uh berries back. Yeah, every day you can actually go back and get the berries from the tree. It's very useful. I, I, I would do it. Why why not, you know? And apparently this this guy I notice when he says that, he'll actually just change it to day when it's night, and it's really... I don't know, it's a lot of waiting and no fun at all, but that's what he seems to do, so... Hey man, whatever whatever you want to do. 
I will not be judge. All I know is we are here to get some Pokeballs. And because a little more is always better, and one more potion will do. Alright, and now we can finally get on our adventure! It's time to start our Pokemon League Challenge! Hopefully no more Pokemon, though, because I don't want to deal with that anymore. All I know is we can get more berries. <sighs> Alright. So now that we have, like, a crap load of berries, I, I wonder why how our backpack can fit everything, and... I really do love the super speed in this game. It's very useful for cutting out battles and making it go very quick. And here we got a trainer. How are you doing, trainer? I just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak? Come on, let's battle! Ha ha ha. You're gonna... You suck. And that is some short shorts, man. Youngster Joey wants to battle. Alright, well, him and his rat attacks can do whatever he wants, because uh, Dylan here is going to just kick his ass. Yeah, we're... we're... Although, I do kind of like rat attacks for my own weird reasons. I don't know why at all. They're very weak. Sorry, I just took a drink there. Um... Yeah, they're pretty weak, but once they get into Eradicate and learn Hyper Fang, and you can give them Shadow Ball, and that's when they actually learn some decent moves. I like them, and then Super Fang is also very useful too. But it's really your opinion, whatever you want to do. I don't, I don't care. Yes, I am. All right, I, I guess I'm forced to, no matter what, because that's just how Pokemon works. Okay, so Mike. I th I'm guessing it's Mikey, not Mickey, because that'd be kind of that'd be kind of interesting. I never. I don't think I've ever met a person named Mickey before. Maybe I have. I don't know. Let's try Rage. Maybe uh, Rage will be a little better. I know you get stronger after you get hit, so your attack raises. So it is useful. I think your I think your attack raises once every time you get hit, and you can just continue on raging about with your, uh, Brooklyn Rage here. Alright, more Rattata's. We're just, we're just gonna go and rage quit all over this, uh, Alright, I, I <laughs> enough of the corny jokes, I think. Then again, I could tell corny jokes all day. Aw, oh, you had a miss, man. I could probably tell corny jokes all day. But oh well. Alright, well... Yeah, more stuff. That, that That's nice. I guess we're just gonna be starting off the route where we don't get anywhere really, and we just kinda end up, end up just fighting a bunch of trainers, and that's really all we get to do. That's a uh, cool story, though. Ah, okay. Bug Catcher Dawn. Hello, Don. How are you doing today? And he's his little Caterpie thing. Well, that's a weird animation there. Is that? That's that's new. But, I don't know. That just that just looks so weird. I mean, it makes no sense. It looks like his antennas just got bigger and then shrunk again or something. I don't know the logic in that. I just don't. And I also have noticed that Dylan has not learned Water Gun yet. I don't. I think it's like 13 or something. Probably 13. We'll find out. So now that Dylan has cut open Chikoritas, Caterpies, and a bunch of other crap, we're done here. And there goes Dawn, and he's all sad and stuff. But we're like, too bad for you, man. And we just continue on. Alright, well, now on Route 31, I'm going... I... Hopefully... Yeah, never mind. Alright, I'm just gonna go over here, and you jerk! Alright, well, let's get that ball here, and it's a potion, and it's if we don't have enough. Okay, guys, well, I'm gonna end it off here. Next time, we'll continue down this way, and in Dark Cave, you can actually get Teddy Ursus in the morning, but I do not have any energy to record before 10 o'clock, and I set it to real time, so that's what I would have to do. So, oh well, I will see you guys next time.